music is already playing. An update is required. I wonder what that means. All of the numbers, as always, are amazing. You guys are awesome. You rock. Thank you for watching, commenting, all that stuff. Over 50,000 views. Crazy numbers. YouTube's weird. I like it. It makes me happy. All right. Magicraft. We're starting a new run because Meteor is stupid. Yeah. It's Meteor that's stupid and not me. Definitely. Why is there a tent here? Game? I would like to go inside. There is new stuff in camp. Huh. You there. Okay. This all looks the same. Cool. There weren't any patch notes that popped up or anything. Magician set. Okay, this is still the same. We could play. Oh no, 450 to upgrade? Wait a second. What is the upgrade? Level two. Wait, what the hell is level two? It just looks like the same. It just has level two after the name. This one, at least I see what it's doing. Weird. Coming soon. Wait, finish chapter two. Find condition. Finish hard chapter three. Coming soon. There are new characters. Let's go get them. Anything else? I was thinking about playing as the magician, but now we're not going to. Was that banner always there? Probably. What are you? Interact! Leaderboard! It was not always here. Steam leaderboard. Do I have Steam friends? What does this mean? Difficulty. Hard. Version 0.7. Normal. Are any of you my friends? I don't think so. A score of 932. That looks like a time. Local leaderboard. This would be my friends. Probably. I need to make friends. Okay. Let's do this. Start the adventure on hard for sure. So wait, should I be trying to speed run now? Cause I'm totally not doing that. The mushrooms have changed. They look different. Bam, cool down. Wait, what? Oh no, that automatically casts. Okay, that's a good first spell. Max HP, let's go get some spells. Especially now that I know I have that passive thing. Those look like they're giving, like, a healing aura to nearby things when they die, maybe. Maybe? Why would I do that? Because there's a heart right there, and it would be wasted if I didn't take the damage. I like that they're updating this game pretty frequently. Energy saver. Unnecessary. Hover. We could take that. Coins or a relic? The easiest relic, where am I? You fall. Push it, push it. It could, there was a butterfly. I saw it right before it hit me. Okay, so these butterflies will not crash into anything. So I do have to shoot them. Cool. Why did I go grab that health before I killed the last enemy? I like this one quite a bit. Let's do it. Although, I have to be careful with my potions is a thing that we have learned. That was so painful. I did get a comment that I could have just went back to the main menu or restarted the game. And it doesn't save until after the room, I think. That would be kind of cheaty. But that was pretty painful. I, I don't think I want to cheat like that. I don't know. I go back and forth. I don't know how much I care. Like, I kind of enjoy it when I get to start a new run anyways. And really, that didn't make a difference. Another comment I got was that the meteor one-shot me with or without the extra damage, which was very true. Meteor did plenty of damage without the coins to fuel it. To power it. Do I have a key? No. Okay. Mushroom. Hey! 
It is our friend the key. What are you? What are you? Recover HP. All damage increased. This one's kind of good. 30% chance to... I want things that give me shields so that I can do devil deals. More damage. I like the idea of Berserker's Eye. Kind of. Let's go spend our key. What did we get? Midas, transform all non-boss enemies in the room into coins. That would be good if I could hold it all the way until the one that creates the little tadpoles, but I don't think I get to hold it that long. We already have more spells than I have room in the wands for. And we have decent stuff. I just need more wands. And more relics. And less brains. The brains are so angry! Okay. Chalice of Greed. Gain coins equal to 5% of your coins when entering a new area up to 8. Or 20% damage. But the coins are kind of like 20% damage. We could get 8 coins every time we go through a room. It's so good. Also, there were permanent stats from that potion I could have thought about. But I didn't because I don't care. Does an elite count as a non-boss? Probably not. Do you want to jump into my... Frozen hovering shots. Okay, I would like to not take this damage, but I'm not quick enough. Okay, that thing did almost enough damage to kill me from my current HP. So I would like to kill you. Okay, I would die now if I get hit by anything. We're supposed to be unlocking new characters. Look at this, free health. Easy game. I wasn't worried for a second. Post slot, charge 15 points per second while standing. Huh. Or navigation, which is pretty awesome. Full salvo, five. So this wants to fire five things that will go homing. I'm just gonna take it. I like it. Especially because I have resonance. What does that do for me? Very little. Cool. Oh. <laughs> That's a lot of scatter. Scatter plus 80. Okay. But they have homing. Wait a second. That's not actually that bad. Let's go get some more spells. I could use spells right now. Right now. Okay. Don't take damage. I only have 23 HP for some reason. Unbeknownst to me. That's a word, right? Butterfly. Um, butterfly has automatic homing. Overload scatter. We could have tons of scatter. And less cooldown. Bam! All of the scatter. I have another key. Since when? The butterflies would want this. 30% chance to automatically cast a spell when using other wands. Sounds good. Another key! Unlimited keys. Look at that. Our little butterfly. It doesn't do much, but it's out there. It's doing things. Did they slightly nerf this? The MP cost goes to 60%. The spell duration and damage used to be 80%, I think. They just decided to slightly nerf it. Okay. Or I'm misremembering. One of the two. Okay. That's a lot of scatter, I'm noticing. Even with the homing. Also, that's a lot of poison projectiles. That's a lot of spiders. The crits do good damage. Butterflies. If you could take out these spiders for me, that would be excellent. Right now, is it tracking... It tracks the enemies, not my mouse. I knew that. There are snakes. Snakes are a pain. 
snakes on a plane. Yes. We're rich. Which may not sound like much, but the more money we get, the more money we get. Yeah. The rich get richer. Yes. These are things that happen, and they do more damage. 20% more damage. And with crits, that will do even more. So we could get more money, but we're already going to get so much money. Let's go get relics that'll get us even more money. Somehow. I don't know how yet. We're going to find out. We got butterflies. The mana is going down, I notice. That's a poison nest. Okay. Good stuff. What are you going to be? Piercing arrow. Big crit damage. Big crit damage. Max HP sounds pretty good. Coins are going up. Okay, I should, like, auto-target all of these little slimes. The trees... I'm sorry, trees. What is that called when you're an unintended casualty? Maybe just unintended... There's a word for it. Slow down time. Bystander? There's a different word. More key? No more keys. Discount potion. All items in the current room will be sold at a discount. Maybe someday I'll go to a shop and we'll do that. We have 69 money. I don't have much to reroll. I just want more money. I want money forever, and we're never going to drink a potion that gets rid of it all, because why would I ever do that? That's not a thing I would do. Hide. Easy game. And we got a key. Let's go. And we're going to use the key discount. Slow down time. Transform all non-boss enemies. I should be doing that. Because once we max out the coins, I get more coins. I forget how many I need, but it's over 100. It's like 150-ish. Red. Okay, top right is red. Okay, top left, red. Okay. This one, also red. Bottom right's looking pretty good right now. 60 HP, 20 shields. Bam! Easy. Okay. Okay, there goes 10 of my shields. Okay. Bottom right, top left. What? I wasn't even close to that. There go all of my shields. Now what? This one? Yes! How did I take 20 damage? That was so stupid. Crits are good right now, though. Crit rate. I don't really need the hover. We'll have hovering butterflies, because why not? Crit rate, 20%. Easy crits. There is a shop, and I do have a discount potion. Someday, we're going to make use of that discount potion. I got five gold for coming into this room. Midas potion. Why? Oh, I could... Sh no, we should have already used it if I was going to use it. I should use that Midas potion. At some point in the future. At some arbitrary nebulous point. We will decide to randomly use it. I think centipedes just count as a single enemy. Hmm. Four enemies does not feel like enough. I thought about it. Okay, but what about four enemies? Still doesn't seem like enough. 60 HP. But what about three enemies? That... <laughs> Once again, we have the key. I could have orbiting butterflies. I could have disruption ray. Hurrah! Okay, don't knock me back. Disruption ray is pretty awesome. 
I don't think I want it to cast off of this one, but maybe I do. Let's find out. Will it knock me back? It totally will. And does it interrupt? It does not interrupt. It wouldn't home either, though. Hmm. That requires a little bit of thought. So, like, I could switch up this being on this wand, and it would do big damage. And then I could do this, and it would hover afterwards. I wouldn't need the overload. I could have the overload. Okay, so now I would go to this as my main thing. The main thing is that it knocks back. And it shoots out at a weird angle. But I think it would target the enemy, so it would be really good, maybe. Potentially. Oh, that must be the 80% scatter that's making it shoot out to the side. Maybe. Why would it always shoot out to that same side? Also, is it hovering afterwards? It is! It seems... Oh, what if we do this? <laughs> it does slow me down quite a bit. I kind of like it. It does make moving a little bit of a pain. Wait, why didn't it hover that time? Does it just sometimes decide to hover and other times not? Explain yourself, game. Every other time it hovers. Is that true? Okay, what is going on? Stop. Uh, why? Why? Minus five... <laughs> <laughs> no this one's not that bad I have 121 gold I don't even know what all these do I don't remember why does the game make me do these things that it totally forces me to do my Midas potion gain levitation don't care do I take damage when I drink a potion? I don't think so. We could go double hallucination. I don't even know if I've ever used a hallucination. Midas. When we're going up against a boss. Okay, I hit two thinking it's going to change my potion, but it totally doesn't. You have to click it. I knew that. Can I click and drag? I totally can. Okay. We're ready to slow down time. What does this cup do? Gain coins. Got it. This disruption ray might be stupid. What if I have it split? That makes it more expensive. What happens at the end of this? Is it going to knock me back in crazy ways? What are you doing? Okay. And are those still going to home in on the enemy? Hopefully. Okay. What if I just did the rainbow instead? What if I just put the rainbow on here? That seems reasonable-ish. Okay, what if I took this off, put this back on, and just, like, went crazy with it? Right, disruption ray interrupts... My normal casting? Disruption Ray is weird. I don't think I should be using it. But it does so much damage. Let's just put butterflies out into the world. That sounds way happier. Look at how happy the butterflies are. And they're homing, but butterflies are already home. Huh. They're big and little butterflies. Okay, wait, let's change things again. Because I am indecisive and I don't know what I'm doing. And yeah. Because why not? Shrapnel. Rainbows? Okay, I think I would put the splits on here. And let these hover. It feels reasonable. There's a lot of scatter to that. 
What about instead of hover, I just do this? No, why would I do that? The hover seems good. I could have it cost less. How much does that lower the damage? 5 by 7, 12, 12. 6 by 7, 15. Kind of feels reasonable, because then look at all the little butterflies I get. And they hover around me. Maybe they'll do things. Maybe they won't. They'll think about it. Let's go. Into not the boss room. Why do I have a spooky thing? Because I can't shoot for the first... Right. Okay. So, I do have ten shields at least. Does this help me not be able to sh or the fact that I can't shoot? Oh wait, I can shoot! Why can I shoot? Maybe I can't shoot after taking damage? Okay. I still haven't taken damage yet. I have shields. Just kill it before it hits me. I still have shields! We've done it! I can go make stupid decisions now. I love making stupid decisions. They are my favorite. Book of Silence. Charge 20 points per second while standing. While standing still, spells cast by this wand have no recoil. Yeah, but they would still disrupt me if they were, say, Disruption Ray. Spitfire. Scatter plus 12%. When holding this wand, MP regen times 20%. When holding other wands, MP regen on this wand plus er, times 150 Look at the cooldowns. This is an amazing autocast. Butterflies. Oh, I want something more expensive than butterflies. Is that what I want? Huh. It's kind of good, but it doesn't cast very fast. Because this doesn't cast fast enough. Cast a spell when using other wands. Crit rate, big scatter. Right, because this casts all of my spells at once. I don't actually think it shoots as quick as this one would. Yeah, look at how much quicker that goes. So if I'm just trying to trigger this one like crazy, which might be what I'm trying to do. Then I would throw the butterfly onto here as well. But I'm missing out on the auto targeting, which is pretty awesome. But look at the sparkles. If this didn't disrupt me, it would be amazing. Alright, put this back. I don't know what I'm doing. Making questionable choices. What do you do? Picking up coins will restore the same amount of HP. I love picking up... Yes! 20 points of shield. I like all of these so much. I can't afford them all. Look at that. We can afford those. I could have discounted them. That would have been really, really smart to look at right before having done that. Okay. Forget that. We're not trying to do that. That would be cheaty. If I had thought to do it, I totally would have done the cheatiness. The funny thing is, I'm not even using my main wand. I'm using the sparkle rainbows. Which is kind of stupid, because... Okay, I can't fire for the first six seconds. As long as I'm horizontal to you, you shouldn't... I think I'm dead. Okay, the curses and the not being able to aim, and for some reason I feel like I had a bigger hitbox than normal. Basically, I made questionable decisions. I would like more of this, and more of this, and then... That's it. How are we doing for time? 24 minutes! What if we went one more and we'll just do the first area? That's it. Because I do stupid things.
I could just end the video there. We have Troll's Blood. Gold or max HP? Max HP because if I get the boss deal, I want to be able to trade for the expensive things. Because they are good sometimes. Kill the stone before it reaches me. Kill the brains before they shoot me. Okay, we'll go get a spell book now. Had to find myself. Who am I? Where am I? What do water slimes do? These are questions that we ask ourselves while playing Magicraft. Okay, okay. Why do I do the things that I do? I shot that egg so it's gonna hatch. There's a water right there. Invincibility? Is that what that said? Immune to all damage for eight seconds. That sounds kind of cheaty and amazing. If I get enough damage, I could kill a boss in eight seconds, maybe. Probably not, but maybe. I could use that! Probably not for deals with the devil, because that's max HP, but for some stuff, I could use it, for sure. Rebound. Don't hit the trees. They didn't do anything to you. Max HP. Let's go. Big damage. Bouncy shots. Kill the laser things. Cool. Negative. Max HP is already pretty decent. More books. Kill the butterfly makers. Yeah, I still don't know what the mushrooms are doing. Um, rebound's kind of cool, but poison. We'll take poison. More max HP. Easy decision. How's my mana? It does go down slowly because of the rainbow. We got a key. Sweet. Elite time. Do not use my potion, even though I'm a little bit tempted to. Keep it poisoned. Uh, okay. Still poisoned. Still po- No! Get back here! Okay. No, the poison fell off. The poison would have killed it by now, I think. Now it doesn't matter. Well, it does matter. Okay, my mana is low. Mana's back. Poison's doing 10 a second. Easy game. That was just the first elite, not the first boss. Sticky Fang, final damage times 120%, scatter plus 3%, slows things. Didn't it used to do their projectile? No, I think it was that, Never mind. Knight's Oath, I don't like the idea of it doing things when I take damage, we're just taking Sticky Fang. Sticky Fang is good, right? Yeah, it is. And it has more space. More room for activities. Cool. If I hit walls, things will bounce. I like it. The mana's pretty decent. It's moving into slot one. Go get a relic. Destroy the snakes. But try not to hit the trees too much. Okay, run away from the snakes. The saws will do a little bit of damage. The poison will do a good amount. The saws are messing them up. Cool. 
what is this? Gain a shield equal to the amount of lost HP up to 50. That could be really good to hold on to. Reduce the indiscriminate damage taken to 1%. Let's go. That could allow for stupid things. Although, if you do enough damage, 1% could still be a lot if you're doing like a thousand damage. I guess 1%'s only 10, but still. What if I do 10,000? Good jump, slime. 10,000 seems reasonable. Except that I do I like doing lots of little hits versus one big one. Grant immunity to venom and slow in the current room. Fart venom around and slows enemies behind you for 10 seconds. Immunity. Shield. Hey, it's shield. Good deal. There is a shop. Just pointing it out in case you guys were curious. I like this potion. I forget what it does. Does it double things on the ground or everything I'm currently carrying? I think it's the stuff on the ground. But I like it. Why did I eat that poison? Who knows? Okay, stop popping up. Cool. So, this potion. I like... I guess I don't need this one. Cool. Okay, read you again. Copy HP recovery, shields, coins, and keys on the ground in the current room. And the mim Mimic Cube. With a Mimic Cube, I have one key. With a Mimic Cube, what would I copy? Wait, does it really copy it at one cost? Or at no cost? No. Does it? No way. That's actually kind of cheaty. No. Huh. Okay. Oh, I don't like pops with poison. Pops can go on here, though. This can go here. Pops can have troll blood. Cool. What else can they have? That's it? That's it. And I still don't think I'm really using them much. But I could. Oh, no. Lose one coin every time I enter a door. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I should have duplicated everything. We're still going to. Oops. Why can't I just think before I do things? Okay. Remove a curse randomly. Yes. I wonder if I have any that cause me damage when I drink them. Double the amount of keys you currently own. That sounds really good. Hey, we got rid of pocket watch. Whatever that was. Relic option. Minus one. Lame. Huh. 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 Okay. I'll double the keys. Bam. Midas potion. Overall. Maybe it was good? Relic option. Increase casting interval and cooldown. Traps increase damage. That's not bad. Lose max mana. That kind of sucks, but not that bad. Lose the coins is painful. Let's go. These are kind of a pain. But the early ones are easy. It's the later ones that are kind of a pain. Okay. Rocks scare me. Rocks scare me. The blue rocks really scare me, because those are the ones that pull me in and they rush towards me. I could have just let the poison kill it. I'm pretty good against butterflies. Keep an eye on the flamethrowers.
Bam. Cool. Endless bottle. I like endless bottle. Endless value. All right, what are we trying to do? I want something that auto casts. Maybe I should be doing piercing things. Maybe. Hard to say. Is it hard to say? Maybe it's not. No, that seems pretty good. Maybe I should be doing damage up things. You can be doing damage up things. Let's come here. Let's do this. Let's come here. 88 money. Money doesn't currently equal damage, but I still like my money. 80 mana. Don't care. Leg wire. Kind of care. Hmm. No. Arcane explosion. Kind of care. Um. No. Extended range. No. Give me something. Okay. That's pretty good. Butterfly. I need something that auto casts. Split. Nope. 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 Accuracy. I do like accuracy. There are things you can do with crit in this game. Thunderstorm is pretty amazing. Especially with poison. Let's just look at it for a second. Do we see how good it is? That just got them to 188 poison. You can get 180 stacks? They buffed poison. Hmm. That's hard to say no to. The rainbow's good, but... Two damage ups. Oh, I don't need rebound or piercing for this. Rebound, you're gone. Arcane explosion. Huh. Two pops. Okay, Pop, you're not supposed to be here. There we go. Much better. Damage up is pretty good. 38 DPS. 45 DPS. This does not auto cast. Right. But if I do cast it, at least it casts two pops, right? Kind of. Not really. Okay. Would I re-roll this poison? I could. I don't really need to. I'm trying to get a third pop. Acceleration is kind of good with the lightning field. I think I actually like that. Mana use is pretty high. Alright, relic time. Hit tab. Watch out for the poison trails. I could place some pops. They have troll's blood. Oh, fight's over. I knew that. More damage if I have more gold? Okay, I can't actually blow that up. I don't have anything to blow these up. I knew that. 34. Okay, I should be ready with this one, Midas Potion. Okay. Oh, that's not that many enemies. I thought that the spider's nests would count. Permanently increase. Well, kind of works. I could have looked to see if I got a relic that worked with things first. Worked with potions. We have a lot of keys. Very many keys. Dodge chance or recover HP. Let's go dodge chance. 
Sounds kind of fun. You there. Free magnifier. It's amazing. I did take 10 damage for it, but doesn't matter. Amazing. I can't even break the stupid berry bush. Which is fine, because I don't need to. Okay. Do we drink this? Maybe. I think so. Do I place the pops? Probably. Venomous spider. So yes, definitely. Here. I drank the potion. Will it be wasted? Yes. We have five pops. I think that's all I get. Just stay ahead of the poison and we're good. My mana's low. The pops are regening. The pops also tank the hits for me. They're so good. I can't poison this, but it's almost dead. Okay, I've taken no damage. Okay, but I'm about to get trapped. It's dead. We have done it. We get a deal with the devil with 176 max HP. I don't have a way to do anything good. Okay, scatter plus 10% post slot charge 10 charge 20 points for every enemy killed with this wand. Festive guess, gift. Right. Okay. Handy wand post slot charge 3 points every time a spell is cast with this wand. It comes with a lightning dash. I kind of like the one where when you move, it casts a lightning dash, but I don't know about this one. I mean, it seems okay. You just put like some quick cheap spells on there and it has two slots, but two slots isn't that many. Neither of these are that appealing to me. I don't like that I have to use a four slot for this one. I think I'm going to take this one. But yeah, it's not super appealing. Three. And I don't have stuff that casts very quick. I don't think I'm using that. I don't know. Let's go look at our deals with the devil and see what stupid decision. All oh, one slots plus one. What does that do with these? We have to find out. When entering a shop or witch work, a side room is guaranteed. I don't care about that one very much. Cast in a random direction. I kind of care, kind of don't. It's pretty cheap. We'll take it. I could get this just to get it, but I don't think it's that good. It's okay. Is it good? For 60? I don't think it's good for 60. I'm going to fight one more room because game is weird. Next chapter. But then we are calling it because we're already at 43 minutes. Which is a good length for the video. I can't break these. Onwards. Oh no. I should be fine-ish. I think. Don't fall in the hole for no reason. I have tons of keys. But my spells move pretty slow. Why don't I have a bunch of popcats down? There we go. Much better. What do you got? More keys? No. I still can't currently break any of the stuff. Merlin's robe is amazing. For free? It's so good. Wait. Will this room have reset? Do I have to go to another room? We're going to call that good. All right. For now, that does it for this episode. Thanks for watching.